our people deserve good health. They deserve good nutrition. Make it soul food and healthy soul food. There's a lot more awareness now of you know what can we do ourselves to to make us feel better. For me, it was more about health. I got to a certain age with with number with, with a zero in it, and I made the switch for that reason, and it was great. The beautiful thing is that most of the customers they're not vegan; they just making a slight change. If you're trying to live a plant based diet, right, and you want to give up dairy. One of the hardest things for most people is cheese. It's hard to substitute for it. Cheese has so many flavor components, so many layers, and people try our cheese and they immediately, oh my God, thank you. It's growing so much in fact that we are, you know, holding on to the reins, just making sure that we keep up. Everybody's talking about ricotta toast, ricotta toast, ricotta toast. So I'm about to make some ricotta toast. Lizzo did a TikTok video using our cheese. We appreciate that, Lizzo. The last I saw it was like 10 million views. This cheese, it's fire. There are a ton of, of benefits from products made like this. People do have this misconception that plant-based diet is too expensive. That's not true. As far as the misconception that you can't be healthy, you can't be strong, that it's boring, just simply not true. It's just being creative in a different way. You know, there are a lot of folks that go to a plant-based diet and they just start eating crackers and cookies. They're slamming carbohydrates in their bodies. You know, with, with all these diets, it's true. You don't want to just put anything in your body. Most people were not raised to think of as plants as meals. Most most people think, well, a vegan diet is you just take the chicken off of the plate. No, it just requires a little bit of, of thought in the beginning because it's meat, but it can be as rewarding and or as satisfying as any other standard uh, uh, diet. I mean, listen, I'm from the South. I'm from Houston, Texas. Those greens, those those fat fats, they, like all that stuff, like it tastes great, but it's just not that good for us, right? Soul food is the food that feeds the soul and keeps the community alive. And soul food is the food that we have had traditionally that we, with all of our creativity, made good anyway. We have access to more. So I think we can make it soul food and healthy soul food. A popular plant-based company, Misha's Kind Foods, treating 100 families to kindness packages. We feel responsible. Because of that fact, we started another company, a nonprofit called Misha's Kindness. We give 1% of our profits back to the community. We have a program called Feed Our Family. So we give seven to 10 days worth of fresh farm to table food to families throughout Los Angeles. We're working on a program that is an urban farming program. And so we have a perspective that we want to contribute to our society. So my son's name is Misha and um and smish this kind foods. This is going to be a legacy for our children. And I'm reminded every day of uh, why I get up and do this. You know, his name is, is, is a constant reminder and, and driving force. Mm -hmm.